Hello, it's wonderful to see you. <laughs> Troy's out back in his little hideaway. <laughs> Dean, do me a favor. Could you get him to turn the stereo down just a little bit? Sure. Great, thanks so much. <laughs> Hello, Allie. Carrie, hi. How are you? Am I interrupting? No, come in. I'm just in the middle of making dinner. Would you like a glass of wine? Oh, well, I left the car running. I just wanted to come back and return your dish and say thank you. It has been such a relief to not have to cook lately. Everyone has been so nice. Oh. What? This dish. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Wait, is it's not the right one? Oh, I got so many. I mean, you know, I've been driving around all night returning them. I'm, like I say, everyone has been so nice. I don't believe I brought over a casserole. Can you hang on just one second, Carrie? Allie, am I making a mistake here? Bill and I were meaning to come over, Carrie. Really? You just get so busy. No, but I'm certain. I mean, you came over. We had coffee. We talked. Right? Or am I... just imagining the whole thing? Is that what I'm doing here? Am I just... imagining all of it? I'm sorry, Carrie. You just get so busy sometimes. I'm so embarrassed. I don't know what I was thinking. I mean, here you are preparing a nice family dinner. And, and I just come in and interrupt everything with no reason at all. Why don't you stay? I really can't. I have so many dishes to return tonight. Everyone has been just so unbelievably nice. So we'll see you on Sunday, Allie? Sunday? Oh, don't tell me that I forgot your invitation to Troy's memorial. It's this Sunday. Of course, Carrie. Right. We're looking forward. We'll be there. Oh. And I, I wanted to let you know, just in case you were wondering. Yes? In no way whatsoever do I blame you for Troy's death. Good night. I was up all night reading. Morning. I really want to talk to you about this book. Oh, certainly a lot of activity around your house lately, Terry. Well, I am getting married tomorrow, Carrie. <laughs> oh, I know. That's just so wonderful. But I, I did want to ask. I don't mean to be rude. Oh, go ahead. Well, uh, your people are parking just wherever they like. Oh. And the cleaning crew, those, those Mexican folks, they backed right into my yard. Look here. You can see just right up over the flowers and not a word of apology. Oh. Oh, Carrie, you mind if we deal about this a little bit later on? Oh, you know, I didn't mean to cause a problem, especially now while you're preparing for your wonderful wedding. Oh, well, it's just that I have a million things to do today. I know exactly what you mean, because you know I'm having the service for my son tomorrow, and I have things to prepare as well. And I will definitely need my fair share of parking spaces for my guests. I understand. <laughs> I don't mean to be a nuisance. Not at all. But, um, oh, I did want to tell you, just in case you're wondering, in no way whatsoever... Point taken! Hello, Debbie? It's Carrie. Johnson. Oh, I guess it is early. <laughs> right. Well, I'm calling because I just wanted to tell you, in case you were wondering, that in no way whatsoever do I blame you for Troy's death. Hello, Timmy? Is your mommy there? Well, can you take a message, sweetie? All right. Write this down. In no way...
It's my fault. I know it is. I didn't even know him. I didn't know my own son. Troy wanted to play guitar in a rock band. Be famous. But he knew he wasn't any good. And he felt stupid for wishing that. He had a crush on this girl since he was 13. But he never talked to. But he probably wished he would have. He liked you. But he felt sorry for you. And he was afraid that he'd be like his dad. <laughs> he was really, really smart. But uh, he kept all his ideas to himself. Unless you asked. And he took great pictures of people without them even knowing. I miss him. <laughs> you know? He was my friend. He was my best friend. And I hate myself. But I didn't even know he was about to do this. Thank you.